There's a highway crossing the bayou Feels on the side, open sky When I roll through, it makes me smile Justin Moore, you you had the honor and he recorded one of your songs. Talk about that. That's incredible. That's crazy. Uh, Justin was Justin was the first, I guess, like major label artist to take hold of one of my songs and put it on a record, and uh, I'm really grateful for that. And that was kind of the thing that that snowballed my momentum and let me kind of move here and start to make the jump to doing songwriting full time. And uh, it's it's a duet with his, with Miranda Lambert off his latest record it's called Old Habits, and uh, I mean it's it's probably one of the most special songs I think that I've written just because of all that's come from it and um, and I got to write with my good friend Brian Mayer and Josh Hogue and mm -hmm. uh, so getting to see that actually have a little success is, is pretty awesome. It's a great song. Well thank you. And I mean that, did you have to like, pinch yourself when you found out? It, ha it happened really fast because I, I mean I was still, it was before I moved here that mm -hmm. we wrote it. It was right after I started making trips up here. So we wrote it on a Tuesday and then I sent it to Jeremy, and then the next day uh, he calls and says, "Hey, we want to put that song on hold for Justin." I was like, "You got to be kidding!" Well, this is easy. I mean, I'm a, right. a songwriter, pff, it's easy. You just write a song, send it in, and somebody <laughs> cuts it. Uh, you know, turns out things. You know, things don't work that way all the time. But, uh, but for you, they worked pretty well. <laughs> it, it worked pretty well that day. Yes. So. And from this, you actually have your your EP out right now. Yeah. Wheels or wings. Wheels or wings. Uh, so, so Jeremy Stover, um, we, we kind of started talking after I moved here, like what would it look like for me to um, not just be a career songwriter, but to kind of have an artist, um, an artist career of my own. And, and that kind of culminated this past year in 2014 of getting to go in, record these six songs that I have, I had written over about two and a half years. And uh, we took, I think two of, or six of the, we took six of the most, Probably commercial and 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 probably coolest songs. I think that that kind of encapsulate my thing and, and how it can be brought to country radio or just the commercial space. And and uh, I think I, I think Jeremy killed it. And Andrew De Roberts, my good friend, co-produced it with Jeremy. And uh, I thought we kind of came up with a sound that really that really works for works for me, but also I think is cool and interesting and kind of off the off the beaten path from what's out there. Yeah. With country music. Well, I think so too, and I think your fan, uh, fans, I mean, it went on to iTunes to chart it. Uh, what was that number two, one, number it, one? It, it topped out number eight on the country charts. Eight. eight. I mean, that's massive. That's in how many artists, country artists there are, to rank eight on iTunes. That's quite a feat. That was. It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Who knew, I don't know what those what those algorithms are like, or what you have to do to get there, but uh, but it was cool. I think it's well received. The blog seemed to like it, and. Um, I think people, generally speaking, enjoy it. So, well, it's a quality product. It's Thank a really you. good CD. I've listened to it multiple times, and you know, when I, because we had met back in, oh, it's been a while, October, November, October, November, something like that. Some, and when we talked, I went back because you had sent me the uh, pre-release of it, yeah, and I got to listen on SoundCloud, and I was blown away from it because I thought the writing was so good, the sound was so clean, so crisp, and it was something that I think needs to be heard on country radio. Not saying that it's not being played, but I think it's something fresh, something new, you know. Thank you. It's actually not being played. But <laughs> well, but I mean I'm just kidding. but I mean, you know, th there are good quality country songs out there, yeah. but I feel like this is these are new and fresh, a new take on it. Thanks, man. I yeah. I really I really appreciate it. Um, you know, we we worked hard on it. We worked kind of all summer kind of putting it together slowly and uh, and I th I think I think the pace at which we made it uh, is one of the cool things about the record that sets it apart because mm -hmm. a lot of thought and a lot of hard work by Jeremy and by Andrew, like especially, really went into it um, to make it awesome. And it came out good. So good job on Thanks, that. Man. Good job, thank you, Jeremy. And what, uh, who was the other? Andrew De Roberts. Andrew De Roberts. Good yeah. job. Well, uh, so we've got wheels or wings. What's next? What's upcoming? We're going. You're going on a tour. Uh, you know, it's. It's hard to say you're going on a tour because like a tour is like you start and then you end right. somewhere. I'm playing a bunch of random shows this year, uh, and, and I'm gonna get to go out for a couple of days with Steve Mokler in April. Awesome, um, he's great. Gonna be doing a couple of random like festivals and things over the summer. 
I'm I'm playing on a I'm supposed to be playing on a cruise, but that hasn't been announced yet. So I well, I, I won't say which one. Right, is, with, but by the possibility of that. But the possibility of that That's is really great. cool. So yeah, um, I've never even been on a cruise, so I don't know how that works. And you're playing they guitar on a lot. boat, and then you're, <laughs> hope I don't get seasick. We'll see. They feed you a lot. They so feed you be fully fed. Oh. And, yeah. And hopefully not seasick. Yeah. I, well, I don't think that you can get seasick because you eat so much. So that stabilizes it. I don't know. know if that's how science works. I am. But, <laughs> but I hope it yeah. is. Yeah, I think you'll be okay. But that's really cool. So you got some big stuff coming up. And ho hopefully, hopefully this year, um, things like this, get, getting to do, getting to do things like this that kind of expand my reach and put music in front of new people. Mm -hmm. um, and see people respond to it. That's kind of what this year's about for me. It's just, just slowly starting to grow. You and know? you're going to be releasing a song to the radio as well. So we're we're going to be doing a, a single to XM this summer. That's great. And uh, and so so hopefully it's well received there, and and uh, hopefully we can grow from there. I think it will. So. And you know we're happy to be a support here any way that we can help at the show. And uh, we really do believe in you. And so I, I just thank you for coming on today. Man, thank you for having me. Thank yes. you for giving me the opportunity to play for your people oh well i mean they're your people too so oh. yes yeah <laughs> what what song are you going to be performing can i ask? uh yeah sure uh, i'll be performing a song called places places all right places. Well, great well we're excited thanks for coming by today yeah thanks for having me thank you well until another experience adam hambrick chris berkman signing out